What are you doing, Nick? Oh, I was just uh, building this this really nice castle. I have Princess Sophia. She's right here. She's hiding right now um, from the prince, Prince Henry. He's uh, coming over here. He's running from the dragon. This is the dragon. Uh, so he's going to run over here and try to find her. But she's going to hide right here. And then come over. Nerd. Well, my princess is a sorceress, and she's going to rebuild it. So not a big deal. <laughs> Welcome to Demolition Ranch. I'm here with the Reaper, Nicholas Irving. What's going on? What's up, dude? Not much, man. So this is actually Nick's idea. Oh, uh, you have some sand in your hair. Oh, my hair? I don't know how that happened. I have no idea. <laughs> I low crawled from Afghanistan to here. Gotcha. It happens. It but happens. you've probably hidden behind a wall that you've built or your buddies have built, I presume? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Little and, bunkers and stuff like that. And they make them out of sandbags and yep. whatever. And so we thought in a worst case scenario, you got bad guys shooting at you and you need to make a wall to hide behind and you use stuff that's around you, how could you do this? Mm -hmm. So what do we got here, Nick? We have 2% water. <laughs> yeah, that water came out of the river. Probably shouldn't drink that, it's a little green. And play sand from my sand castle. Yeah, and this is just straight up play sand like you would have in a sandbox. And then we have the gravel. Gravel, can't really see it too well, but it's, it's this stuff. Little bitty rocks. And these are just anything you could find around, you know, if you were needing to build a wall. And we put them in milk jugs because mm -hmm. everybody can everybody can find some cheap milk jugs. So we're going to see what these can stop. We have three different calibers. We're going to start with the smallest and move up to the strongest and see if we can get a bullet through here or if it will stop. What was his name? Bob. Billy. This is... Billy Bob. Billy Bob. That's Billy Bob. He is the guy we want to protect. So we're putting him behind a jug of water. That doesn't seem like a very good idea, but we're trying to protect old Billy Bob. He's probably going to get a face full of bullets. You think so? Very soon. I do. Let's let's check out this gun though. You guys haven't seen this gun. Nick has not seen this gun. It is brand new. So this is a man. It's an SBR. Chambered in 9 millimeter. Look at that thing, bro. This is made by JP Enterprises. It is like, they they say these are like the Ferraris of the gun world. I like that. So it's like super that. nice. And then on the end, we have an Amtac over barrel suppressor. So this barrel is like, the barrel probably comes about here. The barrel is actually shorter than these handguards. And the suppressor slides down over it. And so the suppressor comes all the way down to here. So a nice, quiet, and compact package we got a vortex optic on there look at this thing it's not the prettiest thing look you've ever seen too, man. yeah the trigger's really cool so it's uh it's a precision trigger there and it rolls so it keeps your finger in the same spot every time so you can charge it from the back like normal or it also has a side charger uh -huh. option here so you can do it like that man. and it doesn't cycle when it's firing obviously but uh yeah you a very cool toys, man. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty neat, yeah, right? Yeah. A very nice gun. I fired it like twice just to see if it fired. It seemed fine. And uh, we're going to really shoot it a little more today. It takes Glock mags too, so it's 9mm and takes these regular Glock extended mags. You can also put just a Glock 17 mag in there, a regular. Bro, we could have used this on the moon op. On the moon op? The moon op. Yeah, why would you need it on the moon op? During particular? the red moon? Well, you know why I turned red. It was a crazy night. Um, a lot of bad guys up there, but we could have. On the moon? Yeah, that's why it turns red. We normally do uh, <clears throat> moon ops for training. It gets invaded sometimes, and we have to clean it out. And that's just alien, you know, their bodily fluids after you, you know. That was so. What makes it the red color? That's what makes it. That's what makes it red. I just thought it was like light or something, but light. Yeah. Ever seen red light? No, it's true. You got me there. I just put that scope on there today, so it's not sighted in. But just shoot it back at those metal targets and see where it's hitting. Well, that was pretty dead center. Good enough. All right, fire a few. Oh, that is so cool. I like it. I like that. Uh, I think uh, we're ready to go Ooh, ahead. Let me just... get one more, bro. All right. Woo! Okay. All right. Oh. Send it through our water wall. I think 
that Billy Bob's dead. You think so? Yep. All right. Oh. He oh has, my gosh, Bill, Billy Bob got hit. Billy Bob has a hole in his face. Yeah, he took- Is the bullet still in there? Took one. Yes, it is. Oh my god. There it is. So pretty. Oh. Very nice. That trigger's pretty cool. Right? Um, I think it's going to... I can't decide. Stop. Get it. Wow. Good hit. It went all the way through. Nope. No? Nice. It knocked this down, but it did not did not go through. So that bullet's in there. I actually want to retrieve that here. So shortly. sand will stop a nine millimeter. That's just pure yeah. kinetic energy right there. Stop. Look at that. Cool. Look at that. Dude, this thing's pretty slow. Perfect, isn't it? Yeah. Let's just shoot this thing some more. Yeah. I would not want to be on Nicholas Irving's bad side. That is nice. This is nice, man. Is this warm? It's not even that bad. No, it's it's not it's not even hot. It's just barely no. warm. You look good with that gun. This makes me look good. Nick found the sand bullet. Oh yeah, it's like totally flattened. Mm -hmm. That's not That's bad. cool. The next gun you guys have seen, Nick has not seen. This is a mm. Zenith mm. Z43P chambered in 556. Dude, oh my that's pretty cool little gun. Yes, it is. There is no way that the water is going to stop it. No. But we got our boy Billy Bob back behind there just in case. Dude, I just like to do this. Yeah, that is the coolest part like about those kind of guns. Right? The slap, the tactical slap. Wow, I like that. Are we good? Yeah, you want to shoot those targets back there first? Get the feel Ooh. for it. Thank you. Oh. Ooh. So loud out of that short barrel. Isn't it? All right, I'm ready when you're ready. Heck yeah. You know what? Lieutenant Dan, just get one. Shot Poor Lieutenant. Dan. All right, we're good? Yep. Woo, did you see that thing? <laughs> he flew so far back. Billy Bob dead. Weird looking. Yeah, it didn't go through though. Wow. Nothing. Nothing. Well, that was actually really impressive. I was kind of thinking it would go through. Woo. But did it go through? Oh! Did not. No. We have our new target set up. Water, sand, gravel. Now we're going with 50 BMG 50. out of the Barrett. And Nick is shooting an armor-piercing incendiary round oh, yeah. at that water jug. Pretty sure it's not going to make it. What? Your elevation set? Uh, yeah, you're gonna want to aim about four inches higher than where you want it to go, because we're so close. I'm standing, so this probably I'm just gonna send it. All I'm right. Cross there's land. Perfect. I'm gonna hit it. I'm not gonna say that too loud, but I think I'll hit it. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. Uh. <laughs> That's it. Yep. Done. And, and that one was full of gravel, gravel back behind it, it, and it's done. Gone. So safe to say, these are not going to stop it. No. no. <laughs> but for the sake of science, we're going to go ahead and try anyway. The next two rounds, I'm going to fire them right in a row. This is just a regular full metal jacket. That's going on our sand. This one is an incendiary round. It's not an armor penetrating incendiary round, but it should do a really nice flash and maybe throw gravel back at us. It's a good test for penetration. Yes. Penetration is good. Penetration is great. Rapid fire from, so tell them how you're gonna do it. You're gonna do one gonna, after the other. I'm gonna do kind of what you did. I'm gonna come down and then I'm gonna hit that sand first and then I'm gonna go straight over and come down and hit the gravel. Boom. Ideally, I'm not a sniper so I might miss. You got it. You ready? I'm ready. Oh! Did I miss? No, you got it. All right, next one. Oh! Good gosh, bro. That one flashes a lot. That was a big flash. Woo. Man. Straight yep. in. Whoa. Oh. So it went in this way, I guess. Yeah. Straight in there. Blew out the back. This one, wow. who knows, but it's dead. Look. It burned the outside of it. Dude, that big flash. I was like, man. That was cool. I it turned into paper. It hit my screen with gravel. Shout out GoPro. Yep. Look at all this. Man, dude. It threw that stuff everywhere.
if you're building a homemade wall to protect yourself from bullets, uh, if, if it's a 50 cal, just just walk out and take it like a man. You know. You have to. You have to. With that. No need to hide. That 50 is just. It's a monster, man. It's Those monster. are the ones you got to catch. You know. Quick. You got to be quick. I've actually seen they make some kind of like walls that have a bunch of uh, like marbles in them. Uh huh. And so it's it's so it can take like multiple bullets. So you shoot it and it hits a marble and explodes that marble, but then another marble drops down into its place. Mm. It's kind of a, I mean, it's kind of what we were doing with the gravel too, yeah, and, and yeah. sand too. Like whenever a bullet comes through, the other sand's gonna collapse into there and block the next bullet. Yeah, so, kind of cool. Kind of. Like, Armageddon though, you're safe to say the. It's it's. I'm I'm willing to bet you're not gonna get hit with the 50 if Armageddon's happening. But if Armageddon happens, everything is going to you know what, you know, hide behind some sand or gravel. Yep, for sure. You're good. Five five six up to. What do you think? 308? Yeah, I think it'd stop at 308. Me, me too, bro. Okay. Next test. The next test. Boom. Go check out Nick at Official Reaper 33. He is an author, a New York Times bestseller. He has a new book out, right? Yep. Uh, Reaper Ghost Target. Yep. And he'll have info on his Instagram on how to get to that. We'll also put a link in the description. Go check me out on Instagram too. Uh, it's Dr. Demolition Matt trying to grow my Instagram so I can uh, get a million followers by the end of the year. Don't forget the DR in front. The DR. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dr. 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 Demolition Matt. I'll write it right here. Thanks for watching Demolition Red. We love you and we'll see ya next time. Contact. That's a great idea. <laughs> what about the quad hog? Bobby!